What is up, ladies, girls, and gentlemen? Hope you are having or had a very wonderful Christmas. I know I did. Some of you guys asked me to do you know, vlog kind of videos where I'm talking more about me and my life and not just all about video games. And I took that to heart and I'm gonna try to, like in the new year, try to make some more videos on myself in more of a vlogging context. So I thought, you know, maybe using Christmas videos like this would be a nice introduction to a new vlog life of which I know nothing. So, what did I get for Christmas? So I don't know how you guys celebrate Christmas, if at all, but we always have stockings. There's one that has my name on it because my name is Benjamin. So we just fill the stockings with um, all kinds of goodies, sweet stuff. And the stockings are always the first thing you open, you know, because it's, I mean, no insult, it's just sweets in there. The big gifts come at a later part of Christmas. You know, and then, you know, you get the usual stuff. I get a lot of gum because I chew a lot of gum. It's already opened. People know I like gum. It smells so minty. Then I got a whole bunch of dark chocolate because people know I like dark chocolate. All kinds of like, this is like 99% cacao which is a little bit strong even for my taste but i'll give it a try and then we got some exotic stuff like lemon with a touch of ginger or intense orange i have no idea what that tastes like got some snickers always need snickers and then the really fancy stuff these bad boys oh my god this is greek gods used to feast upon desserts like these oh so good and then there's my sister the angel that she is bought me harry potter birdie bots every flavor beans if you don't know the Harry Potter beans, these are beans that have genuinely like every kind of disgusting flavor known to mankind. I mean, they have good stuff in here, like, you know, like lemon and watermelon, banana. But they also have stuff like booger, dirt, grass, <laughs> vomit, soap. And then the worst of it all, they have cinnamon. Oh, I can't do cinnamon. So that was the stocking portion of Christmas. Now we move over to the big stuff, the gifts. Christmas has gotten really difficult over the past few years to buy gifts for everyone, you know, thinking of thoughtful gifts is nice and all but it, it takes up a lot of time so what we do um, every year is just everyone creates a little list of stuff they want and we just pick a couple of stuff from that list and buy that and then like add one thoughtful gift instead of multiple thoughtful gifts and my family usually just sticks to my list my family consisting of my mom my dad my sister and myself so with our very efficient list system in place all i had to do was create a nice perfect list of semi-expensive stuff that i wouldn't buy for myself usually but others can buy for me so I'm gonna show you the gifts, but bear in mind, there's kind of a theme to the gifts here because um, the past semester at university, I, 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 I brought my Nintendo Switch to school to play with my friends. I, I originally, I bought the Switch somewhere in the summer because I wanted to play the new Pokemon Let's Go. Then I started bringing it to school and then we started playing Mario Kart together. So what I did now was I just added all kinds of Switch stuff to my Christmas list. So, so that to add to enhance the gaming experience that I share with my friends at university instead of studying And I, I genuinely thought they were gonna buy like maybe two or three things off that list But I think they got every single thing on my list <laughs> Freaking steering wheels for Mario Kart power bank for the switch because we ne we always run out of battery at some point There's like a little stand there to stand your switch while you charge it I'm um, this is like really first world gifts. Let's please take a moment to recognize that people around the world are starving and are very poor. But look, I also got new controllers. And then I got three games. Number one, Mario Party. The game where you lose all your friends. Number two, FIFA, because everyone loves FIFA. And then you got like Pokemon Tekken. I'm not really a fan of Tekken, but I figured it's a, probably a game that my friends want to play. So yeah, a whole bunch of Switch stuff this Christmas. <laughs> I also, I also got these pajamas. Ooh, huh? It's so soft. Oh, and it hasn't been washed yet. It's disgusting. And what my sister did, she made this little thing here. It's, a, it's, a, it's an ATM box machine. It says stuff like, it says, you know, Lines Bank ATM. Lines is my last name, by the way. Then it says like insert card, receipt, and then it says cash. And there's like a little slip there. So she had like a little bit of money looking out there and it had just like, pull it out <laughs> and then on this side you got like you know in enter your pin and all that then you got like the number sound there and it's, it's just a little diy box thingy and it's it's really creative and it's really clever and i appreciate that hard work my sister is 28 okay she's not like an infant child who made that so props to her well done and i got a little bit of money for christmas and i like i like to i like to show the swiss money because i think they're so pretty this is your 50 with a hand on one side and freaking mountains on the other side. And then there's like a parachute dude somewhere there. Then there's another hundred here with an old dude. I don't even know who the guy is. And then on the other side, weird mangly aliens. It's art of some kind, but I have no idea what it is or where it is. 
Here's a rare one, it's a 200, I hardly ever see this. But the image here in the middle, I think is a reference to the uh, the Hadron Collider. And then on the other side, you got like the National Swiss Gang sign or some kind of tutorial as to how to pleasure a woman. I don't freaking know, I, 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 I don't really interpret money, I just spend it. And every year my dad buys like lottery tickets on like the ones you can like rub open. It gives us that kind of like adrenaline kick on Christmas, it's fantastic. Oh, by the way, in case you were interested why I, I wanted a stand, the Switch stand for Christmas is because the Switch itself, if you don't have one, it actually has like a little hind leg at the back where you can just open it up and it just, it, it's essentially supposed to stand on its own and it does a, a minimal job, but it's so like thin and flimsy and crappy and it's only on one side. So if you like stand it there and, and if you so much as just sneeze in the direction of the Switch, it just topples over. And this thing is so diddy and crappy, it like, it pops open. It, it's not broken or anything, it's supposed to do that, which is a nice excuse, but it's so crappy. And I may look very spoiled this year, but trust me, I had to spend a lot of money on gifts too. Like my mom got a cell phone. I gave my sister cash to buy a new cell phone because she's an iPhone girl. I also bought my mom a steamer because she likes to steam her food. And then like, my dad, I got a uh, Google Home. So, I mean, they weren't they weren't cheap gifts, okay? So I'm entitled to have my little chocolates. Side note, I got like a rubber band on my chair here, like this one, right? to do like you know back exercises because I like the twin at, at the tender age of 25, I already have back problems. Not serious. It's just like you know, doctor tells me to you know you should sit up straight more often. I'm like okay. What I also have here is a nice gift from Amy and Craig. Thank you so much, Amy and Craig, for sending me this. This is my fan mail. I'm so honored to get fan mail, I never thought I would in my life, but oh my god. To Ben, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, love Amy and Craig. Seal up tighter than a chastity belt. Ooh, oh my god. It's a, it's a Game Boy change color glass. Can you see that? It's over here, look. Dude, I'm gonna open this right now. <laughs> so like now like, the screen is blank, but if you fill it up with something, it changes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fill it up with something. Because if like if you if it gets cold, then it says Super Mario Land start. This is fantastic. It looks just like the old Game Boys I used to play with. Thank you so much, Craig and Amy, for this. And that's, that's just the first gift. There's a second one too. <laughs> this is one of the thoughtful gifts. It's it's a London bus, but it's it's a Kit Kat bus. It has it has Kit Kats in it. <gasps> Dude, there's so many Kit Kats. Look at that. Oh my god, so it got the thick, crunchy ones. I love that. Oh my god, that's good. That's really good. It says know your servings. One bar equals one serving. Doesn't say how many servings for one person. So. The chunky Kit Kats are the best. I like my chocolate like I like my women. Dark and chunky. I just had a whole bar, no remorse. Actually, I got Christmas dinner later on. I shouldn't have been shouldn't munch on chocolate. Thank you so much, Greg and Amy. This is gonna this is gonna last me a full weekend. <laughs> it's got like images of people in the bus. You see, then there's this Asian guy just plotting, plotting and scheming on stealing that woman's child. Look at him. <laughs> well, hey, that's all for my end. That's the gifts I got this year. I hope you guys had a very, very Merry Christmas. It's always my favorite time of the year. All the lights all around when you go shopping, you hear all the Christmas music, so Christmas movies all the time. I always watch Beavis and Butthead Christmas special. I used to watch Home Alone a lot, but then it got boring. But the best thing about Christmas is gonna be later on. I'm gonna bring all of my, you know, Switch stuff with me to Christmas dinner, and then we're gonna have a blast playing all the Switch games. Well, I will, because I'm gonna win. I hope you guys had a very, very Merry Christmas. Hope you enjoyed the wonderful time with you. If you didn't celebrate it, then hope you had a very wonderful day off. If you didn't have a day off, then I'm sorry. But have a very wonderful Christmas, a very wonderful New Year. Say hi to your family. Just tell your family you love them. And by the way, I would appreciate ideas for vlogs because many of you said that I should just have like vlogs where I talk about my daily life. And my daily life is essentially, you know, either work or go to school and study. So those are really going to be very boring and very short videos of me doing absolutely nothing. But if there's anything, any like topics you want me to talk about, anything you want to know my opinions on, then I'll gladly make a video for that. Otherwise, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for showing interest into my gifts and Snickers and Kit Kat buses. You guys mean the world to me. Have a very Merry Christmas. Have a very, very Happy New Year. I hope to see you very, very soon on the next video. You guys take care now. Bye-bye.